Hey guys, welcome to Liberty Studios. My name is Solo Ashio and um, I just have a few tricks to show you on Photoshop. But right before we jump into that, make sure you like, subscribe, share and comment. That would help us a lot to grow a bigger platform for everyone to I mean, learn and um, interact. Let's jump right into this video. So it's actually very easy to do things like this because yeah, I've been on most of the time, you're shooting beauty, you're shooting fashion and you don't know exactly how to fix some skin discoloration. It's very easy. So right in front of me, I have like, a, like an image opened up and um, I actually wouldn't do so much adjustment because I feel like everything is actually right. The lighting is perfect and um, I can build from here. So I wouldn't touch so much i wouldn't push so much around in terms of exposure contrast uh, highlights shadows everything is good so let's not waste time let's get into this because this shouldn't actually take time so open this file so right around here you can see a major skin discoloration i wouldn't even let this go i can't there's no how i would upload this image without fixing this and not necessarily you have to do a lot of work before fixing this even without any frequency separation or even dodge and burn on or any any other technique you can fix this skin right before your major edit so before i go so hard on this image the very first step i'll do is click my eyedropper tool and once I'm able to click my eyedropper tool, I'll click like an area that is close to the kind of colors I'm going for. I'll click my solid solid color. So once I'm able to select my solid color, it would pick the last color that I was able to pick using the eyedropper tool, then hit OK. So the next thing you want to do is change this blending mode to color. So once you're able to change the blending mode to color, just make sure you click on the layer mask and invert by hitting command i or control i on windows so once you do that you click on the brush tool once you're able to click on the brush tool increase your brush and uh, your flow can be around two percent just to build from two to four to six and so on and so forth then you keep brushing And guys, yeah, fixed as simple as possible. Like very, like, it's like the simplest thing you can do. Very simple. This is our before and this is our after. You've been able to get rid of skin discoloration, which can be a big deal to some people. I mean, to a lot of photographers out there, including myself, because I actually don't like it, but it is not it's, it's actually not a big deal it's something you can just fix by pushing around a few buttons which we've been able to do here so this is the before and this is the after you can tell that the red magenta kind of look that the chin was having we don't have it anymore because we've been able to rectify it so guys that's just as simple as a b c and this is the best way you can fix of course, we, you, we still have so many other ways in which you can fix things like this, but this is one of the best ways you can use without wasting much of your time, without spending so much time on Photoshop, or even without even doing any frequency separation or even dodge and burn. I guess this would help a lot of people out there, but make sure you subscribe and share for more videos. Thank you guys and see you guys in our next class. Bye.